And actually, this is an adventure of the adventure journey of the uh, R&D development on this signing up. Why I share this with you? Because uh, in Hong Kong, the education system tell you what is an invention. An invention, when you are in the kindergarten or primary school, the teacher told you that when the apple falling a tree and hitting the head of Newton, then there is a, the Newton's law is run. By this way, just an apple hit on the, the head. But actually, I find that this is totally different story. Maybe um, we are not, not good enough. So I share with you some, uh, in 2012, we already have all the idea. Most of the idea is in 2012. We have the idea how to construct a uh, lightweight structure. We have different idea to how to reduce the window, although it's not detailed enough, but we have all the idea. Then we, we finally take another few months to file to let the panel open. It's the only practicable way to uh, reduce the window. Then we tidy up all the idea, make a provisional patent on uh, April of uh, 2015. Uh, and then uh, we uh, establish a new company to do this R&D work. Uh, because we found that uh, when people doing the consultants work and R&D work, normally they would uh, the R&D work will be uh, totally stopped because the consultants were there is that like whatever whatever, and the R&D work is um, even you don't do you have no progress, it's no problem because there is no kind to push you. So we once we uh, establish a new company, we have dedicated engineer to work on it. Then we really uh, start the R&D process. Then after how many months? 18 months. After 18 months, we can see the first demonstration to the client. So it is actually 18 months of hard work of a few engineers in order to achieve this. Uh, what I want to share is th this adventure is actually need some kind of courage because most of the trial are failed. So if we, we test 10 different uh, weights, now of maybe 10 are failed. So this is how, and actually our company, they, many staff don't like to work on the R&D group because the failure rate is so high. So this is, uh, the, we test the uh, air tip, so this is the air tip inside the Type C panel. Uh, we test multiple layer and then find okay if multiple layer it will give sufficient uh, noise insulation. Then we put up it, and in the beginning it looks good, but a few hour later it looks like this. And then we different way to put up it, trial, and we trial different uh, layer to find out any any different way to make a lightweight structure and high performance, high sound insulation performance. Uh, this is an idea we try a few months and finally we give up. This is a, a horizontal hinge opening. When the wind blows it, it will open like this. Like, like this. And then when the wind does not blow, it will close up automatically. In principle, this is very good design, but we try many months and find it is, the design is too complicated to, to make it practicable. So at the moment, we give up this idea. And this is the first one uh, we try the uh, magnetic uh, ceiling method. Then we, uh, in the last year, May, we uh, joined the uh, construction symposium to promote this idea. Then, uh, then we try different ways of to put up the roof. This is very lightweight. Just the, uh, the air tip and a flexible mat. The entire weight is less than one kilogram per meter square. And also we make a, a enclosure. So in the uh, uh, first job in the WSD pipe replacement job, actually we may also make an enclosure, so they can make a noisy work even at light time. This is the ventilation. Uh, there is a bowler, then the ventilation fan blowing air out. This and we make a noise measurement at different 
uh, location, different height. And this is, I forgot how high it is, maybe it's an 8 meter height microphone. Uh, 8 meter height is quite high for a low volume to do a noise measure. But at the moment, we can make 20 meter high microphone. So if there is 20 meter high microphone, we don't need a crane. We're just using our technique to make this. We spent many years to develop this. And this is on site how it looks like the enclosure. Uh, we also test different type of the wolf. We try to, at, at the moment, we cannot find a good way to make a wolf. Uh, we found that even a very slow, slight wind, it would uh, very sensitive to the wind. Uh, six meter high, seven meter high. So we all this this is already done the prototype. And then eight point three meter height. Uh, we are sure we can make it, but at the moment we are not sure this uh, carbon fiber tip is strong enough. So we are requesting the carbon fiber tip manufacturer to make a stronger fiber, carbon fiber tip then we can make this eight point three meter. And uh, we, we test this uh, this panel. In the first one, it only gave us 7 dB reduction because the noise leakage of this. Then we seal up the gap by using the tap. It changed to 17. Last week, we using a specific way to seal up the gap. We, give, we have 20 dB reduction. OK, this is the future development. Uh, we will sure making this uh, 8 meter high carbon fiber tip and we already done the uh, prototype testing. A is the uh, detailed design, B is the top prototype testing, C is the on-site installation and then we think we will uh, do it very soon. Uh, by if we make this vertical barrier turn 90 degree then it become a wolf top, a wolf cover. And we have the design for 15 meter wide shop. If you have a shop want to cover it at night, we can cover it. If it is not wider than 15 meter, we can cover it after 7 o'clock without using any machine and give you around 20 dB noise reduction at the cover. So, and if I think we, we are able to make it up to 20, but we uh, don't need more time to design. And we also make a canopy top, about 5 meters. And this is another idea. We have already an idea how to make a noise enclosure tunnel for the concrete lawn mixer. So we can make a tunnel of 10 meters or 20 meters long, starting from the side entrance to the uh, concrete unloading pond by this tunnel. And the entire tunnel can be constructed at night time after 7 o'clock. So uh, then we, uh, then for talking about the piling weight, the piling weight is very high, it's higher than 8 meter. Uh, because it's the small area, and there may be other support from the, the piling, uh, the crane, so we We have idea how to make a 15 meter high noise barrier for the pine weight, and it is possible to achieve 25 meter. And we are focusing on the type B panel. There is a lot of improvement, and we are designing another type of the base, structure base, uh, other than water barrier. So I hope you will give me more idea how to develop this uh, rechargeable noise barrier. This is the portal from Hong Kong. Uh, two months ago, we win an award from the uh, organized by the Hong Kong Science Park and the Hong Kong Poly U, and we got uh, some financial support on on the loss because we lost a lot during this development. Talking about okay, a lot a lot of money. Uh, so then we win this award, and we are invited to uh, get into the science park. So we are moving into the science park at uh, uh, the. Acoustic Innovation Limited is actually the R&D division of the Wilson Acoustics. It's moving into the science park. In the first phase, we have five people moving in. And then uh, I think later we will have about uh, 15 people in a few months later. So uh, we hope after moving in, we are joining a, what they call technical incubation program. They will tell us 
how to uh, make these laws to be a profit, how to run a business, how to run an international uh, bank, uh, banking. So this is uh, what we are at the moment. So.